Hey guys, this is Ben Anim M1 returning now to Metroid Other M. Unfortunately, this is going to be a short upload, um, only because I'm trying to uh, uh, fit the other time block um, together so that I can just keep going with this. I wondered if this too was a result of the power the baby gave me. Right, you're doing the meeting. Right, so now I'm just going into the um, next cutscene here. I always found that guy a little sus suspicious there. <laughs> yeah. Of course, this whole eye scan thing, this retinal scan, kind of makes you wish that they did that every time you open the door, but, eh. Yeah, not entirely dull. <laughs> Of course, uh, when they uh, showed the inside of Samus's ship, it really made it look much more high tech than you saw in other games. This one is definitely more so sophisticated here. Um, I actually like that how she can just drive in a giant trackball sphere. <laughs> This is the first reference you hear of that sort of thing. Aren't all distress signals in remote part of space? This may not be the first time I'm playing this, but I still get the tingles from that. Ooh, that was a great opening. Yeah. So, now we finally reach our destination of where we're going to be for the entire part of the game. They call this space station the bottle ship. It is of the uh, unique shape that it has. Yeah, I kind of see that. Um, although the rings that surround the top portion of it, yeah, it's a little bit, a little bit of a stretch. Um, but yeah, wow! When I first saw this ship, I was like, "Whoa, this is huge!" <laughs> um, the only time I ever saw a ship of this scope. Uh, was probably when uh, uh, Star Trek did a uh, TV series way back in the day called uh, Deep Space Nine. Uh, but, you know, that ship, that space station didn't even come close to this. But, uh, okay, now we're coming up on the uh, tail end of uh, this LP right here. We just landed, but uh, it's going to uh, just be a little bit before I come back. But, Hey, you know, this is Ben Animan signing off here, and I will be back shortly.